Good morning, everybody. It's me again. It's me again. Uh, I'm on a roll. But anyway, I don't know why I didn't mention this yesterday in my other video, but all of you color purple lovers, did you all happen to catch Oprah Winfrey on Monday where she had the cast, the entire cast of the movie, not the play, but the movie Color Purple. And I just want to say, you know, I'm not a huge Oprah Winfrey fan, but I, I did appreciate that show because um, I, I love Color Purple. I mean, what black person doesn't like Color Purple? I mean, I mean, unless you're a man, unless you're a man, if you're a woman, you you pretty much love the color purple. You know what I'm saying? Most men don't care anything for color purple. I mean, my dad, he hates color purple. Every man I know is kind of like, well, I don't like color purple because color purple uh, bashes men or whatever. But um, that, that's not why I like the color purple. That's not why I love the color purple. I love the color purple because it's an iconic movie and uh, what I appreciate most about the movie is the little small relationships that were built within this iconic film you know just and uh, uh, you just you have feeling for the characters and, and, and their history and where they're going I mean you really really have a sense of love and affection for these characters and I haven't felt this way for a movie in years you know what I'm saying so this is why I'm real critical of fucking Tyler Perry movies and shit like that. You know, it's just, his movie started off okay, and then towards the end, it just fucking lost me. I'm just like, you know what, I can't do no more Tyler Perry films. But anyway, this color purple cast that was on there, everybody looked good. Everybody was well preserved. They've been pickled, worked on. <laughs> and every, I'm, I was very, 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 very proud that everybody looks so good and and you know and they look like you know they they've lived well you know after 25 years it's a great movie the color purple is a great movie you know um despite what you know a few males say you know i love you men i love you men but you all got the color purple all wrong y'all got it all wrong you know, women don't love color purple because of the male bashing in it. And I don't really necessarily think that there's any male bashing, so to speak. I mean, there was only like really one bad male character in the movie, and that's uh, Danny Glover's character. But the movie is very, very iconic. And there are, you know, I mean, even some of the phrases and, and, and scenes in the movie becomes iconic. Like the, the, you know, me and you, us never part. I mean, we've done that for years. I mean, man, do you all remember that? You know, when we were kids, man, we used to fucking do that. You know, me and you, us never part. My Jesus. Come, come on now. Every black person in America used to do that shit, man. And, you know, we knew all of the song, uh, all the words to Miss Seely's Blues and God's Trying to Tell You Something. And, you know, and you get to crying at the end where she sees her sister again after, you know, 30 years. And, you know, it's just, that shit's iconic, man. It's an iconic movie. And there hasn't been another movie since that touched me like that. Well, I'll, I'll take that back. I'll take that back as far as, like, black movies. I'll take that back. There were a handful of movies in the 90s that I thought were iconic for the time, like uh, Boys in the Hood. Boys in the Hood, to me, at the time when it came out, it was iconic because uh, uh, we hadn't seen anything like that before. You know, of course we've seen like, you know, gangsters and hood movies, but we never, uh, uh, you know, fell in love with characters the way we fell in love with the, with the characters in Boys in the Hood or menace to society and movies like that but like I said you know I can't do no more Tyler Perry movies I cannot do it it's just like you know uh, uh, a good friend of mine was like you know we need to go see color girls it's, no no I'll wait till color girls come on channel 11 I'm not even gonna wait till it come on DVD I'm gonna wait till it come on regular TV PBS I'll wait till it come on PBS but anyway yes if you guys love the color purple, 
you all would appreciate Oprah's show that came on Monday. It was, what day was Monday? The, is that the 15th? 15th. So if you can somehow find an archive or a YouTube video, look at that. It's awesome, you know, awesome. Okay, I'm getting a phone call, so I'll check you all later, and I'll see you guys on Friday. Peace out!